obviously. Yeah. Hey, everybody. Welcome to uh, the Monday night team training, uh, Team Vitality. I, I love you guys so much. Gosh, I haven't trained since I think March. So I want to just thank all the leaders who've stepped up the last few months and have done our Monday night team training. You guys have rocked it. We've got to get another sign up sheet. Um, moving forward. Um, but here I am again, and I'm glad to be here. I'm Chrissy Vogt, uh, EC2, for those of you who don't know me. Hopefully by now y'all know me. Um, and uh, I am here with uh, Angie Harper and Kristen Bailey. We're going to train on a very important topic, uh, how to invite your people. <laughs> so um, I'm going to get into that in a minute. But first, being the um, first... Call of August. I love August. Well, first of all, it's my birthday month, just saying. So next Monday, just be prepared to sing to me. I'm a Leo. I want you all to sing happy birthday to me. <laughs> next Monday, the 12th. Um, thus, our uh, team Zoom is 8-12-8-12-1966. So that tells you how old I am going to be. Um, anyway, so... I, I don't know. I just love August because it's like back to school. I know y'all had lots of fun with your kids over the summer, but I'm sure you with kids still are really happy to have them back at school. And I just always loved that, like getting back into a routine and getting more focused on, you know, you and your health, your business, your schedule, right? I always loved that. So um, hopefully you guys are all set and ready and focused for the next few months because towards the end of the training, you guys, we're going to talk about some strategy that we have come up with kind of leading into the launch in October and then um, ending the year with a bang. So, um, so hold tight. We're going to get there. But uh, at the beginning of every month, we like to recognize, you know, new rank advancements, new gemstone ranks, new track earners. I reached out to the leadership support to get the reports for those. Um, we're just a little bit too early. They have to wait until the fifth is over with um, to give me those reports. So um, I'm going to shout out rank advancements. I was able to see those. So um, congratulations to our new senior consultant one, Juliana Joyce. Is she on here? No, I texted her. <laughs> That's yours, Holly, huh? And then new... Um, Consultant twos, Suzette, Suzette Swigman, and she actually lives here in Colorado, and Dora Nogel, Noegel, N-O-E-G-E-L, she here. And the consultant three, Dave Falluni, Falluni. So congratulations on the new rank advancements. Um, do so. Can, can you guys want to like unmute real quick and rank, um, shout out any like new gemstone ranks? It's if it's you or somebody on your team, uh, new track earners. I want to shout out uh, Kristen Bailey and Carrie de Grandmont. They each earned a track and enrollment track last month, which is awesome. And Angie, you earned two enrollment tracks, right? And then it's double points, so that's four points. Four points. Right. It's double. Right. Well, they I got double, no, it's double points for the trip, which they got. So we each got 20 points for the Alaska trip. Yeah. Yeah. The Ala Yes. Okay. Yeah. I got one track, so I got. So it's double points. Yeah. Double points for that. You did too. Yeah. Okay. Congrats. Congrats. Thanks. Thank you. Anybody else? You can shout out just anything, anything, you know, from you, your team that was just. A, I'd like to shout out Clay brought on a new consultant um, and she's got an incredible story. I think she might be on the call right now. I'm looking for her name, but congratulations to Clay. Always exciting to bring on. And Stephanie Brown, I know she brought on a new consultant as well. Sweet. Congratulations. That's exciting. Great time to come on board. Okay, so I'm going to continue on, you guys, because we have so much to cover. Um, okay, so inviting, right? Like, we are network marketers. We are marketing the Life Vantage product, so we actually have to expose uh, the tools to our people. <laughs> That's the only way we're going to 
make money or grow a business. It's we got to get the tools in people's hands so they enroll as a customer or as a new consultant. So we've got to get out there and talk to people and get into activity. Um, so we are talking about the invite. You know, the more people that you guys obviously talk to, right, the more that you have conversations and talk to people and invite, the more you're going to develop that skill because we only have seven skills in network marketing and inviting is the first skill. So it's a skill and it takes practice. And the only way, you know, practice makes perfect, right? Um, and then number two, you're just going to feel more confident, and uh, if you haven't read the book, Go For No, I highly encourage you to read that book because that gives you the confidence. Like you go for no, you know, we're, I think that, you know, the biggest obstacle is fear for people, like fear of what people are going to think or fear of the word no. So you don't want to, you know, to get put yourself out of that box to invite. But, you know, I always think to myself, OK, if this person if I'm not going to reach out to these people, are they going to help me uh, pay my bills or reach my dreams? No, they don't care. They're not there to help me. So I'm, you know, it's, it's, we got to just um, let go of what they're going to say. And I guarantee you guys, if you stay super consistent with your message, people will come back around. We've had, you know, the, all of us who have had so many no's and have been in this a while, they, people come back around and they will eventually say yes. You know, they're going to have a, some kind of pain point and they know that we are the solution to their problems. So um, read, go for no, if you haven't already. And let me know in the chat, like who's already read it. Uh, so what, and so, you know, the more you reach out, the more no's you get, you're also going to get more yeses, right? So, and tonight we want to really give you like some specific oh. things that we're actually saying to people, like how we're getting people to look at the information, how we're following up with them, what tool we're sharing. Because I know that's the biggest question I get from you guys, you know, is, okay, what do I do next? What do I say? Or this is this person, you know, how do I reach out to them? So um, we're going to do two parts. This is part one tonight. Part two is next week. Um, we're going to have Sherry. Uh, and um, Melanie on next week to share some tips and tricks. And um, it's all about the invite. So tonight I'm gonna go over just three A's kind of to help you in your mind, um, three A's to so get your pen and paper out. So the first A is ask. You've got to get good at asking questions. Number one, because it's not about us, it's about them. So the more we know about them, the more we can then provide um, value to them and a solution for them, right? So get out of your way and ask them lots of questions. You know, when um, Dave and I were coming home from our vacation, where we I was on an airplane sitting next to this young gal in her 30s, and you know, she was open to talking. So we're we're talking, and I just I asked her so many questions because so I was genuinely interested in her and what she did on the trip. She went on this really cool hiking trip and just at, and what she did for a living. Just We just had this great um, you know, conversation, but it, I just made it all about her. So by the time we we're kind of finished with that, um, you know, I found out that she was a runner and she's a nurse. So I said, you know, you might be interested in something that I actually um, do. I distribute um, this this um, activated liquid collagen and this Nerf 2 activator that, you know, keeps inflammation down in the body. And I've got a lot of runners on it and they love it. It helps with, you know, recovery and this and that. And she's like, oh my gosh, absolutely. My friend and I were just talking about liquid collagen. So if, you know, if I would have just gone right out there and said that to her, you know, the first sentence, you know, she would have been totally turned off, but I developed that trust with her. So get good at asking questions. We're here to serve people. We have the solutions to their problems. Um, and you need to ask them the questions, you know, where they're at in life and where they're with their health and with, with their finances, you know, and then ask if they're open to taking a look. You're not asking them if they want to be a customer right away. You're not asking them if they want to join your team. You're asking them if they are open to looking at information on what you have because you feel that it's going to benefit them in a certain way. Uh, if it, and then um, you can, you know, if they're for whatever reason, they see the tool or they say that they're not interested, then always ask for referrals. You know, if you're just like if you're a realtor or mortgage broker or all of those 
uh, careers that we base our business around referrals. You know, don't be afraid to ask. You have not if you ask not. You have not if you ask not. When I um, first joined you guys, it was the 15th of the month, the 15th of September, 2016. And I had this vision. Again, you all have to have this vision. Like, why are we doing this, right? And kind of what your goals are, short-term and long-term goals. But I had this vision on the 15th of September that by the end of se se that September, I wanted to have 5,000 in volume. It was a certain rank at that time. I wanted 5,000 in volume. And so I knew I just had to like set aside all my distractions and everything else and focus on my business for two straight weeks and ta start talking to people. So um, I wrote down just on a list really quickly, like all of the people that I knew made health their priority. And then I actually would text them and say, hey, I've been thinking about you. Do you have 10 minutes to check? I wanted to talk to them in person. I just didn't want to send this blank, you know, general message to them. So um, when they said, yes, of course, you know, I've been thinking about you. Do you have a few minutes to talk? Of course, they're going to say yes. So then I'm then um, I'm like, you know, I think about you. I know that you, um, you know, um, that your health is very important to you. And I have been doing a lot of research. I just joined this business in Life Vantage, and we have you know, products that address the number one root cause of disease and aging. And I thought you'd be interested in this. Are you open to just um, hearing more about it, to watching this video? And then I got the tool in their hand. So I was thinking about you because, and then I wrote down really quickly, like all the people that have expressed health concerns to me. So I did the same thing. You know, hey, I was thinking a bit about you because, you know, I know the last mm -hmm. time you talked, you were telling me that you had migraines um, all the time. And, you know, I actually... Um, now I'm part of this company that has these products that help address the root cause of migraines. And then I, you know, kind of wrote down who, who are all my entrepreneurs, all my, you know, um, people that I would want to join this business. And I reached out to them and, uh, and told them about this, you know, asked them if they were open to learning what I am doing now and, uh, you know, earning a second revenue stream. So you guys in two weeks, I got that 5,000 in volume. I had 10 customers. So I had to talk to you know, 20 people to get 10 customers. And I got three consultants and then immediately, you know, we got them on the phone with their people and then they uh, brought on new consultants. So I had, you know, I don't know, five, six, seven consultants on my team and 10 of my personally enrolled customers. They, the consultants had some customers in two weeks. So 5,000 vo in volume in two weeks. Like you can do it, but you just have to focus and you've got to talk to people and pick up that phone. Um, so, and then, you know, specific questions like if we're talking about the business, you know, I like to ask if you don't make any changes in your life right now, like you expressed to me, you're living paycheck to paycheck and you're stressed out about it, or you don't like your job. If you don't do anything right now in five years from now, what does your life look like? And will you be happy with it? Does it look the same? Does it look different? If it looks different, what are you going to do differently? Asking them questions to dig into their heart and their soul and, you know, and have them look at their future. You know, people are busy. They're just like living in the moment. So have them like take a breath and look five years down the road. And if they don't make changes in their health or their finances, what's their life going to look like, right? Life goes so fast. And, um, or, you know, if I can show you how to earn an extra $500 a month, would that help you? Would you be open to that? Right? Asking from your heart. Okay, the number two A is be affirmative. Uh, you know, when you join our team, I always say, hey, when you, you're going to love our team so much, like culture and community is so important to us. As soon as you or when you join our team, I am going to introduce you into our team vitality and you're going to feel the love. You're going to get welcomed by everybody. You're, you're going to join us on our team trainings on Monday night and hear the stories. Like you're going to be so connected with our team. You're going to love it. You know, or when you get on the products, I'm so excited for you to start in the products, you know, you, um, and just in, in, in be a part of your journey. So be affirmative, the second A. And that is posture, right? Posture is knowing what you have and how it's going to help people. 
and they are going to question you less. They're going to be less skeptical if you've got the posture and you're affirmative and you're pretty much just assuming that they're going to join, which is in the third A, assume. Assume the sale, you guys. Don't be afraid. Don't just prejudge them and think, okay, now they're going to watch, you know, the ABC, they haven't gotten back to me yet. They're probably not interested. Do not assume. When we do living room presentations, I am always coaching the team that is there. Assume that they are going to either become a customer or a consultant right after they see the presentation. So whether it's in person or on Zoom, assume that they're going to do something. Um, they might need more information. So three things. They're either going to come on as a customer, they're going to come on as a consultant, or they're going to need more information. But you've got to assume one of those. And be ready. Like if you're having a living room um, presentation, have your computers out. And as soon as it's over, like, hey, how do you want to get started? And assume that they're going to do something. After the, you know you invite them to a Zoom call, you've got to reach out to them right away and assume they're going to do something. So you need to ask them, okay? So, okay, I'm done. That's my 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 little tips for inviting. Now we're going to bring on Miss Angie Harper and Miss Kristen Bailey. Um, let's see, Angie just in the last month enrolled two consultants and four customers. She got two tracks, right for the Evolve tracks. Double points for Alaska trip. Same with Kristen. She enrolled three consultants and four customers. And you guys, I just want to like, I want you guys to step back for a moment and think, how cool is this? You have leaders, not just the three of us, but your other like MC1, MC2 leaders that have been doing this a while. We're still in activity. We are not just sitting back at our desk telling you what to do. We're doing the do. And we're leading with moral authority. That's huge. And I hope that you're really happy and grateful about that, that we're not those leaders. That are, and think about, you know, I've been doing this almost eight years. Angie and Kristen have been almost seven years. And we are still finding people to talk to. We talk, like, we still have warm market we haven't even reached out to. You know, we're all, we're all three diamonds, right? But we still have people to talk to. Um, we, we, we all need to step it up even a notch. So, uh, you know, you would think after eight years that we would run out of people to talk to, but we haven't. So just keep that in mind. And I guarantee every single one of you on this call has not reached out to a quarter of your warm market, people that you have relationships with. I guarantee you. So at the end of this call, this is what we're going to do something, I promise you, um, that is going to be very, very helpful. So... <laughs> Angie, we'll start with you. Um, I want you just to pick like one of your consultants you brought on and tell us like exactly how it all transpired, the conversations you had and how well, you actually got them to join. Yeah, I actually rather talk about the customers. So I think that's an even better story. But the, the consultants, sure. one of them was my um, oldest son's girlfriend who just turned 18. She's going to um, beauty school. She's going to be a hairdresser. And so she she hears, you know, me talk in the background and she knows about collagen and she loves our skincare. So she's like, you know, now that I'm 18, do you think this is something I could do? And I'm like, absolutely it is. <laughs> I wish I had started this at your age. So brought her on board. I'm not really plugging her in quite yet to everything just because I want her to focus on school. But um, my son is also a consultant. So I, I placed her under him. So that's exciting. And then the other one is just a good friend of mine who spends a lot of money on product for her entire family every month. And so I reached out to her and I talked to her about being a consultant. And I said, I know you spend a lot um, on product. I told her about saving 20% off of retail, about all the tax incentives because she's a W-2 employee. And so she was like all over it. Absolutely. She also had like $90 in credit sitting there in her account. So we upgraded her and she was super grateful. So I'm not sure how active she's going to be, but you know, we, we heard facts the other day and I can't remember what they are off the top of my head, but about a consultant coming on simply because they love the product and they want to use the product and that consultant even if they're not actively building or showing up to calls, they're more likely to stay on product. Christy, do you remember the, the amount of time versus, I mean, there's actual, I'll say 11 months. 
something like that. It's like the amount of time that that person is staying on product is way longer than, than just a customer. So, but my customers, I love this. So four customers, three of them um, are people that I knew from my kids' sports a long time ago. So one was a football mom, one was a travel baseball mom, another one um, is a football mom here in Arizona. So, um, you know, people that I've known, two of these people I've known for 20 years, <laughs> and they've never, you know, really asked me or reached out to me. I've never reached out to them. But you know what I am, guys, is I'm consistent on my social media. I am very, very consistent. They both saw posts about collagen on social media. Um, actually, one of them saw my gut health stack and wanted that. And then the other, the fourth is actually somebody I don't know. It's somebody from one of the groups that I'm in that um, saw one of my comments, came to my page, got my link and ordered. And so um, I think that's pretty cool. That's kind of my next step is to focus on growing my business um, through cold market. Because like Christy said, I am eight years in now, still, still working on my warm market. I haven't even really touched my warm market to be honest with you i have like five thousand followers on facebook do i have five thousand customers no i don't <laughs> so i still got a lot of work to do so it's exciting that's sweet thank you angie yeah. congratulations mm -hmm. thanks and kristen bless her heart you guys she you know she has kids she works as a fitness instructor and she is not feeling well and she is here tonight because she knows how important it is for her to share. So thank you, Kristen, for being here. And then get off and go to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I'm happy to be here. And it, this is just another another reason for us to do this because it's like even in, in the nooks and crannies when we're sick and not feeling good. Sorry, I sound so stuffy. But we still can show up. And especially if it's sharing what is working for us. Like, I want this for everyone. And like many of you guys know, this is, I'm one year into living in Roseville and the first couple months of me moving here, I was, you know, kind of got in my head and just like anyone that joins this business, I'm sure you guys have all felt it too. At certain points, you're like, oh my gosh, I don't think I can do this here. And that quickly, like it was just, it was a, I had to give myself a self-talk and look in the mirror and actually remind myself of what we do have our hands on and remind myself that I'm only here because of these products and because of this opportunity and then it gave me that like oh my gosh I have to go out and share and my mindset completely shifted and once I did I just feel like I allowed myself to be vulnerable and authentic to the people that I was meeting here and I just met the most incredible people you guys and one of those people one of those humans is on the call tonight and she's the first person this month last month that I signed up as a consultant her name's Chastity um she is the most phenomenal yoga instructor I've ever met and we are so alike in so many ways um but you guys I didn't she actually clicked on my link when I had a story about collagen and we were texting and I got a notification pop up. This is a couple months ago. And she, her and I were texting and I'm like, wait, you just ordered collagen. And I'm like, how? She's like, I just followed your link. She's like, I can't see those pictures anymore without trying it. So that was like, I hadn't even, she knew what I did, but it was really like one of those moments where I'm like, why didn't I just talk to her about this sooner? But she, I had mentioned it in, in passing, but I didn't want to just like needle her with it. And then when the opportunity came for her to join as a consultant, it was just like the perfect, it was the perfect time for her. And again, working with like-minded people, you guys, you want to link arms with people that you have fun with, that you love. And there's no better way to do business. I feel like, you know, thinking back on all the times we've all been at convention together or in person together, it's a party and it doesn't feel like work. And I think that's what makes it more special. Um, so it's, it's really, what was the question, Angie, that she asked? Sorry. Oh, it was on my story. Yeah, right. she wanted to know if you're posting your social media, but you you have your link in bio. That, my link was yeah. um on like my like with the for the story. Yeah. Yeah. Um so yeah, I um this last month 
Chastity was my first um, consultant that I enrolled. And then my, the, the girl that does my, my lashes. And again, too, she kind of came to me and we, we talk a lot and get to know each other a lot. And she's a single mom. And she even said, I think my reach could be bigger to help people. She's like, I want to help other moms. I want to help other, again, that like-minded find, find people who are like-minded to you. And she doesn't want to be working, the, you know, as much as she does. Yet, you know, she wants to spend time with her girls. So, and then the, the third one was um, my childhood friend who I swam with. She's back in Brentwood. She's a vice principal. And she, um, she said to me, she's when, when we were signing up, she's like the fortunes in the follow-up. She's like, you've never not talk to me about this. Like you've never not, you know, kind of whispered in my ear, like you can join me. And she was with Rodan and Fields. Um, and so this was, that was a perfect opportunity. And I'm, I'm really excited for her to, to jump in and be with our team. And then my customers, this is also a really cool referral base. When you were, when you brought that up, Christy, um, you just, never know who's going to refer you. And I don't know how many of you are in groups on social media, but I'm in like hot mess mama group and like, like just different group, you know, hot mess. Hello. Yeah. I, I know we can all relate, but I had, a, you know, they, they always post for opinions, like who has collagen? What can I do about this? And somebody tagged me, like ask Kristen Bailey, she has the best collagen out there. And I got an influx of all of these women who I had never met before. Send me the link, send me the link. So I'm sending the link and, and I was voice messaging them too, as I sent, sent the link. And, um, I got three, two, two customers from that hot mess mama group, you guys, who would have thought. And now one of them's talking to me about becoming a consultant. And then the other one was the nurse that I had shared with you guys a couple weeks back when I was in Tahoe that had actually said, heck no, techno to my face. When I brought up this company and these products, she kind of laughed at me and was like, don't ever talk to me about this again. And then come to find out years later, her mom's having some health issues and she's like, I need you to help me. What should I get? And she ordered that and her mom's feeling it. You guys, I followed up with her and her mom's feeling better and getting some relief. So again, all of it is like, who can we help? Like, who could we link arms with? Like, who can we help and make an impact on? And then taking it going from there. So that's my my story. I love that so much. And welcome to the team, Chastity. Oh my gosh, you made just such a great decision. Christy so got happy. to take her class a few weeks ago. She, it was it was really cool. Christy Emerald came and, and took her class. It was so fun. Oh, cool. It's time for me to come out and visit and take your class. That's a good you story, Kristen. Action, action, action. So, I love it. Yes. Um, you guys just hang on, hang tight. I know we're at 30 minutes, but give, give me 10 more minutes at the most. Um, some things to piggyback on Kristen, um, that you had mentioned the fortunes in the follow-up and I love, and I remember this is the very first time you shared on our call, you know, almost eight years ago. And when we're training on follow-up and you just do like little heart emojis, like if you you know, if they're crickets, you know, you, you give someone a tool or your shopping cart and then they don't do anything. You just follow up with a little heart. That's super cute. And you're still doing that, huh? Mm -hmm. it works. I love that. Yes. Um, and as far as social media goes, um, you guys, we're going to definitely dive into like in September, do some social media training, but on your own and don't sp spend a lot of time or even money on this. Just, you know, make sure you're doing it right. But um, you know, just don't constantly post just about products. I mean, people, people come into the business cause they see, you know, they see our lifestyle. Um, they see our team and how much, you know, how awesome we all are and how much fun we're having and the trips we're earning. Um, you know, the things we're doing with the extra money we're making, there's so much more to it than just, you know, posting bottles of product and saying, here, this will help you, you know, so just make sure you're doing it right. We're going to help you hopefully like in September, we'll do some good basic social media training, but also find, you know, find some training you can plug into just don't overthink it and don't take too much time because we need you in activity, revenue producing activity for sure. Um, and we'll, we will also train um, on more on follow up as well. So, okay, so now for kind of some strategy that we've been talking about, like, okay, how do we best launch, you know, go into the launch of this, 
new product that's going to be a game changer, you guys. You know, something to do with like weight loss, activating our DLP one in a very natural way. Already, we're like peaking the interest right now with people, and they're already like really excited about it. Um, the first thing you want to do though is register for the market meetup in October. Uh, it's in Kansas City, October 10th and 11th. 10th and 11th, right? Um, or is it 11th and 12th? Two days, two days only. And depending on where you live, like I actually have to come in that Thursday night. It's Friday and Saturday in October. Dave and I have to come in Thursday night because we can't make it in time Friday. But you guys, a lot of you can fly in Friday morning and you can leave Saturday night if you want. But this is going to be a bit the big launch and just completely 100% focused on our, our new product that's coming out. So we're going to hear all of the things. So um, I just looked at my registration report and we need, I know there's a lot of you wanting to go. You might think you're already registered. So how you find out is you go to just log into your back office or just scroll all the way down to your shopping site and you'll see events. Click on events and then register for this event. And then you can actually click on register and then go to downline attendance. And then if you know if you've got some people on your team, you can actually see who's registered on your team. So make sure you're registered and then um, make sure you know who is and who is not registered on your team and let's have a conversation. If you need our help, like reaching out to your teamy to kind of um, help encourage them to come, uh, to come, please let me know. We can help with, um, you know, getting other people to share rooms and all of that to save money. Okay. So register. That's number one. If you really want to um, take advantage of this launch, build your business. I mean, from now all the way through the end of the year, you guys, we're going to explode. I promise you. Um, and then Angie had this brilliant idea of, because we know we were talking like, how can we, what, what can we do in August, September, and October leading up to this launch? Um, and, you know, what will our focus be? So Angie came up with, you know, the gut health stack, the Nerve 2, the pre and the probiotic, which we know um, helps address so many things, gut issues, get the gut healthy. Everything starts in the gut, right? And then weight management, it all starts with the gut. So we are, you know, kind of helping people focus on their gut and the gut health stack and getting them on it August, September and October, and then coming into the launch of the new product. Um, you know, we're set, we're setting up for success for sure. And then of course, as we're getting closer and know more about the new product, we'll help you guys strategize with that, but just pull the DMO, go to team vitality, find that daily method of operation. And just from now, just focus on the daily method of operation, you know, reaching out to people, um, plugging into, you know, 15, 10, 15 minutes of personal development. And that's another really quick pro tip I want to give you. If you guys, like when I came back from vacation, I needed some mindset shift. When Kristen moved to Roseville, she needed to shift her mind. So we just went like to find some kind of a book to read or a podcast to listen to to shift our minds. So if you guys are feeling lost in like the invite, if you need more training on inviting people, go find the podcast. They're free, you know, and um, you can find three minute, four minute videos. Go take a walk and listen to more training, more perspective on inviting people. Um, so, so just, you know, follow the DMO mindset training, skill set training is part of your DMO. Um, reaching out to people is part of your DMO. So just kind of take our lead on the gut health. Um, and this is mainly to get new people on. We don't want people to get off of the product they're already taking with Life Vantage and then get on something else, but help them manage that. And then our real main message, and I know we're all doing that really, really well, is activation, right? Because we're going to be activating the GLP-1. Um, and of course, all of our other products are activating certain um, systems in our body. And then doo -doo 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 -doo, we are doing this age of activation, a Zoom presentation starting this Wednesday, every single Wednesday in August, two different times, a.m. and p.m. So the a.m. time is 10 a.m. Pacific, 11 Mountain, 12 Central and 1 Eastern time every single Wednesday. And the PM times are 6 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Mountain, 8 p.m. Central, and 9 p.m. Eastern. And it's going to be Angie and Kristen and I doing all of these in August because we want to make them super consistent 
super the same. <laughs> um, so you guys know what to expect every single time. So if you're liking it, you invite your guests and they're liking it, they're going to invite guests because we're going to share the same exact information, the same exact story. So it's predictable. We are going to keep it at 20 minutes. I, we just reviewed the slides today with the script and it was eight minutes. And then we're going to have our stories attached to that. So um, our focus again is, you know, sharing the product story, the company story, you know, act the, what activation is all about and um, pique their interest with the new product coming out. And the main objective is to show them now is the time to come on board to either get activated on our products and get ready for this new product, but mainly to come on board the business and uh, you know, get your ducks in a row, get your skills, meet the team, so you are ready and can you know be ready for this launch. So we're going to pique that interest on what's coming up in October, and hopefully you know encourage them um, to and pull at their heartstrings to come on board now. Now is the time, you guys. So with that, I hope you're excited about that. That's all I want you to focus on is tuning in Monday night training. In, inviting into the Wednesday presentations. So I, we're going to take five minutes and then we're going to end the call. But these five minutes are super important. I want you right now to invite three people, not to the presentation, but three people that you've been thinking about on your mind, maybe on your chicken list, or maybe just somebody that you've want, been wanting to connect with but haven't had the time. Reach out to them right now and invite them to coffee or to wine or to a hike or to lunch. Just invite them and just connect with them. So I'm gonna stay quiet for a minute. I want you three people invite. I'll do the same. How's that yard work going out there? Looking good. <laughs> when you're done, put in the comments that you're done with your three people. We just lost four people. Who were they? <laughs> Chickens. <laughs> okay, one more minute. I've got one more activity for you. See, Chrissy, this is why it's so important to have conversations going in Messenger. Like any given day, I have like six or seven conversations going. So when something like this happens, those are the people I go to first because those are people I'm already having conversations with, right? So it's not weird. <laughs> mm -hmm. Absolutely. Exactly what I just did, Angie. Yep. Super easy. And that's what I love about Messenger. Like that, yeah. this, this keeps track for me of who I've yeah. talked to, what I've said, where do they live, what are they interested in? It's all right here. Yep. Well, and you guys know that when you text and, and messenger too, but it's also text. If you're mm -hmm. texting someone, they're going to be the first to see your posts on social media. Yeah. The easiest thing. Tricks the algorithm. Mm -hmm. Okay. One more activity and then I'll let you go. Um, now I want you to invite three people to the Wednesday presentation. <laughs> of course you have Holly <laughs> I no doubt <laughs> it's also in um, Vitality Rock so you can always tag people there too I, I Angie I saw your comment don't ask for the recording 
Yes. <laughs> yeah, we actually are not going to record this. We're gonna, you know, if if, if we have a really clean one, um, we're going to post it on our YouTube channel, our team YouTube channel. Uh, but we're not going to record just because we want to just create that um, that fear of missing out. You so know? is Tense so so the whole the whole point of Wednesday is for people that maybe are interested in the business and haven't really engaged with conversation um, or. Yeah. They want to get us like, do you want to like people that like, what is life vantage? What okay. are you doing? Holly? What is this life vantage you're doing? Okay. You know, hey, come and, you know, for 20 minutes, join this and get a sneak peek at what life vantage is all about. Okay. Basically like third party for you, right. To say, Hey, just come listen, you know, third party validation. Yeah. So we share the product, the company story, the product story, and then we're going to be sharing like our story, which incorporates the business, why we chose this business. Yep. We're going to talk a little bit about the new product, but not a lot. Yeah, not a lot. We don't want to like, we're not pre-launching this product yet. There's a window of time, you guys, that we want to actually launch a product. Mm -hmm. And we're just a little bit ahead of that window. So we're just peaking interest just a little bit, but like corporate is going to come up with some more of a strategy to like really pre-launch it. So we don't want to say too much or give too much information. Um, and you guys, there's, you're going to see there's a lot, there's like they're doing, corporate's doing overviews on Wednesdays. So don't get bogged down with all the things that are happening. Like just know that just this is what you want your people to plug into right now. Forget the corporate ones, forget Wellness Wednesdays right now, um, unless, you know, you've got someone specifically wanting the information on the topic, which we don't know yet, of the Wellness Wednesday. And that's completely product focused. This is showing your team, your leaders. It's going to be, like I said, predictable, short, sweet, impactful. Carrie, did you get your answer your, to your question? Okay. Trisha, I agree. I mean, we haven't had 50 people on a team call in so long. Like, I can feel the excitement, you guys. Like, there's faces I haven't seen in a while. Like, there's brand new people. This is really exciting. Super really exciting. exciting. Yes. All right. Do we have our three invites for Wednesday? Donna, we do not know the cost of the new product yet. I that actually got good. a response. <laughs> oh, nice. What was it? She said, right now? What time? <laughs> <laughs> I love That's funny it. because that training we listened to the other day, Christy, was like the guy was saying, like, literally text people 30 minutes before the call. Yeah. Be like, hop on the call in 30 minutes. Because sometimes yeah. if you give them too much time to think about it, all these excuses come in. I got to do this. I got to make dinner. I got to bring my kids here. Just call 30 minutes before. Mm -hmm. Like, just blitz. Boom, boom, boom. And that's actually a really good point, you guys. Like if somebody says, you know, I would love to, but I'm not available Wednesday, please respond by asking them, well, when do you have 20 minutes? Mm -hmm. We'll find a time. We do these all of the time and just get their answer. Okay. Just whenever they have 20 minutes, get that and then say, okay. And then reach out to one of us and we will be glad to hop on a private Zoom with you and your person and do a 20 minute overview for them. Just, just so I'm clear. So I'm looking at the the um, the invite for Wednesday. So you're doing an AM and a PM? Mm -hmm. Is that what? Okay, yep. cool. Awesome. So no excuse. Yeah, so, they have so that's when you guys are asking, say, hey, what time works best for you? This time or this time? No yes or no questions, right? It's this time or this time. Just like you did with your kids, right? <laughs> that's how we raised our kids. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, you guys, with that, I'm going to wrap it up. Thank you for being here. It was super fun. Come in next Monday for part two and uh, have a great week and we'll see you Wednesday. If you have questions, let us know. Love you all. Thank, Thank you. Bye, guys. So good to see you, Dr. Sandra, and all your faces. Thank you so much. Thank you.